Um, hope you're doing well. Um, how are you? I hope you are doing well. Yes. Um, gonna do a beard care product, a beard slash beard slash hair care product. Um, something that I'm fairly new to doing. You're probably wondering why I am doing this, um, as I have hardly any hair up here, just a little bit here, um, and that around the back, in like with mohawks when I have it done up in spikes. Um, not really got much of a beard at the moment. Normally I do have a much bigger beard. But, you know, at the moment, look at me, you think, what's he doing hair care products for? Um, it's because I'm mainly doing beard ones, but you, you get, I'm doing like the occasional kind of Dax Wax type. Yeah, that's an old tin. I need to get a new one. Um, there's the occasional old occasional kind of beard product that I'm I'm used to um, it will mainly be other beard type products like this one as you will know by now this one is my all-time favorite um, it is from brum, 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 Barber's Bay um, it's just a small niche kind of UK company. It's not a, not a big company, but from what I've seen, um, but they are all over the place. They advertise hugely. Um, they are all over Facebook. They are all over Instagram. They've got their own Facebook and Instagram pages. They're on Twitter. They are everywhere. They are really plugging their product, and I don't know why, because it is very, very good. Um is real high quality stuff um it is kind of it's not high i, w I would say it, it is actually i would say it is in the high price range i mean this was nine pound for one ounce um it should be 12 pound but i bought it on offer and um, for nine it's like 25 percent off um and I'd say one ounce, nine pound. Two ounce, fifteen pound. So that for two ounces would be eighteen pound, which is much more than that. So I would say this is kind of high price range, but it is value for money. You hardly use any of it. Um it, the smell lasts for hours and hours. I can put this on when I get up in the morning and mum will still be smelling it halfway through the day. Um, and I will still smell it at night when I get into my bed. Um, I can smell it on my bed sheets. Um, it is a very strong smell and it is possibly one of the nicest smells I've ever smelled. Um, this is the Snake Venom range. Just like the design of the tin, basically, that's all that is. Um, it comes in, um, I'll just bring up the website, but not for you guys. Snake Venom, it says Barber's Bay Special Edition Beard Balm, 30 grams, which I'll say is one ounce. Um, And it comes in either sandalwood, bay rum, rare oud, adventure, which is what this one is. This is the adventure scent. Tobacco and leather. I must try that one. I really want to try that one. Um, and rose and oud wood. And it says, product details. Barbers Bay Special Edition Regular Balm is handcrafted from all natural ingredients, including beeswax, coconut oil, argan oil, and grapeseed oil. Small batch production ensures consistent quality. This balm has a smooth, buttery texture that is quickly and easily absorbed. Non-greasy, vitamin-rich and naturally nourishing. Give your beard a treat. You'll be glad you did. And I must say, I am. What was it doing? Okay. 
and yeah so it is one of like i say it is a very very nice smell um that was one of their signature that's one of their first smells they came out with it's one of their signature smells um i think or is it one of their new smells i can't remember it's either the signature one or the new one i honestly can't remember um but if i just swap you over now to the website um hopefully you will see the snake venom ignore that 24 ounce that's like for the the design of the snake venom kind of problem like thing it's actually only one ounce i mean a 24 ounce would be like massive um so yeah they have beer bombs beer doors beard washing accessories um they have a strong long beard i must try one of these it's um, d -d 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 for long, time, longer, thicker beards. So when my beard grows back properly again, I will upgrade from snake venom to feathers of the crow. Because it still has the adventure. Um, I want to try the leather, the leather smell. Because I've got, um, I quite like the leather. Um, ba -ba -da -ba -da. It's a stronger version of the regular balm, which is what I'm using at the moment, which is what I'm going to be doing the product test on. Ba -da -ba -da. You got tarantula legs, which is for moustaches. You got snake venom in um, oils. I've just ordered this. I've just ordered the oil in Adventure to see what their oils are like. Because if you'll have seen me the other week, one of my videos, I did do an oil um, for the first time. And I was quite impressed by it. So I'm thinking of trying that a bit more often now. Um, but you have all sorts of stuff. That's my phone going off. You've got beard oils. You've got all these sort of things. You've got a Father's Day thing which is sold out. A bush which is sold out. You've got Billy Goat Beard Balm. Which I'm not sure what that's for. They, they do quite a range as you can see from there. Um, they do colognes and perfumes, free fragrance samples, which I do happen to have here. I have three fragrance samples. Um, and they are really hard to get into, <laughs> to be honest, which is why they're still full. And they have shaving stuff, they have sunglasses they have skin care they have t-shirts have hair care um Yeah, so that's their site. That's one of their sites. And this is just one I came across, which has um, the stuff on offer. But they do have other websites. They have um, other places as well where you can buy their products from. 
I will leave a link in the description if I can find the other sites that they have where they sell stuff. But to open it, um, to show you the actual main thing, I mean, I've been using this for, for a few months now, and I've hardly, I've hardly even scratched the surface of it. And that is, if I can... And that's all you need. Just that little bit there. And that, that's just, that, that smell, it's hard to describe, I really want to, um, I might um, send them a message um, asking what scents they've actually put into the adventure to, to get it that, that really nice smell, because I can't pin a single fragrance out of that, it is just heaven, absolute heaven. Um, anyway, I've ranted off way too long. This is a quality product. If you're into beard bombs, check out the websites. Um, beard, Beards Bay, um, not Beards Bay, Barbers Bay, um, Blue Colognes, they do all sorts of stuff. Um, it smells really nice. I'm going to try and get more of their products to try for you. Different smells different products um and i'll see you all in another video bye the next day okay um so it's been a few days um and i decided i was going to send them a message about the bomb um and um they were decent enough to reply to me um if I just get up what they said. Apparently, the beard balm is scented with bergamot, which is what you find in El Grey tea, apple, raspberry, lemon, with a touch of jasmine and violet, on a base wood, on a base of birch, vetiver, or vetiver, and cedar, with a tiny dab of nut grass. Um, apparently, they say that um, it's more of a fresh citrus burst with a woody, slightly smoky base. Sometimes people say they get a, a leather note to it as well. So, um, oh, I'll call, I'll call them to reply to me with what was actually in it. Um, since then, I have gone and purchased the oil version this is just a sample size this isn't the the big size this is just a sample size and it's the same it's the same scent as the snake venom but in oil form and it comes with a little pet it already comes like this with the with the pet Um, and I've had that on today and that was it doesn't smell entirely the same it has a slightly different note to it whether that's because they've had to change what's, what goes into it with it being a balm and an oil two different things I'm not sure but they are virtually the same but obviously because I'm getting used to these kind of smells now I can smell just a, just a subtle difference um, yeah, that was really all I wanted to say, was just that I'd actually got in touch with them to let them know, or well, ask them what the, the scent was and the fact that they replied, um, which was like, really decent of them. Um, I can ask them how well I like it and so on, and they're going to let me know when they have offers on again, so that I can buy more 
Um, as, as I said, I want to try the leather and tobacco. I think that would be quite a lot of smell. Um, so yeah, I'll see you all in another video. Like, comment, share, do the bell thing, do all that sort of stuff. If you want to see more, I will see you. Hopefully, this will go out on my scheduled program. So I'll see you all in three days' time. Bye.